You all look lovely. Oh, hello, Mr. Whiteface. I mean you no harm. So please don't come at me. That's a conversation I had with a kitty cat several days ago. It's also now the slogan for Black History Month. I have a cousin that's very sensitive when it comes to racism. He called me one day because he was quite upset that he went to a tuba recital where he was one of only three black tuba players. <laughs> and he thought that was racist. <laughs> and I wanted to agree. But then I realized Three black tuba players is a lot of fucking black tuba players. <laughs> if you see more than five black tuba players, you're watching an outcast video. <laughs> been a great year for me. I've accomplished a lot of personal goals. I completed my marriage. That's wonderful. <laughs> my son also turned 10 years old, which is great. It's been a pleasure watching him grow up from a little bitty baby into a 10-year-old fucking psychopath. <laughs> and you can chart his descent into madness <laughs> by how he's changed his stance on pinatas. <laughs> so when he was a toddler, he was terrified of pinatas. And it was my job to vanquish them. Now he treats a pinata like he's a mob boss from New Jersey. <laughs> and Optimus Prime owes him several thousand dollars. <laughs> Guys, I saw a horrible thing recently. I saw a gentleman on a bus with a tattoo on his neck that just read, fuck Linda. That guy hates <laughs> Linda. <laughs> or he has to remind himself <laughs> to be intimate with Linda. Either way, Linda could do better. <laughs> Bought my son a cat recently. You might know him as Mr. Whiteface. <laughs> Got him one from the Humane Society, which may have been a mistake because most of their cats are defective. <laughs> I found this out because when I went to buy one, they said, you can get this cat, but we're 99% sure he's deaf. <laughs> or he's just a cat. <laughs> oh, y'all like that cat ownership stuff. You guys big in the cats. <laughs> Found out horrible news while I was there because they force you to read brochures. Did you know that 40% of all American cats are obese? <laughs> I don't know why you would chuckle at that. 
I'll repeat it so you understand the gravity of the situation. 40% of all American cats are obese, which is only great news if you love fat pussy. Here's Skittles. <laughs> Thank you for your time.